So yeah, this is definitely uh, definitely not true. Uh, almost every OECD country, which is the club of rich countries, allow more immigrants in as a percentage of their population than the United States does. Canada lets in um, many times more immigrants than the U.S. does as a percentage of Canada's population. Um, Australia, about six times more. Uh, Switzerland, about six times more. Uh, the U.S. foreign-born population is uh, almost 15%. In Canada, it's about 25%. In Australia, it's over 30 And uh, New Zealand and uh, Switzerland, it's over 30 um, so it's, uh, in, in, in Singapore, it's, uh, uh, about half. So you're just talking about, we like to pat ourselves in the back of this. Now it is true that the U S and most, uh, basically lets in more immigrants, like the number wise, but the U S is also the third largest country in the world. So yeah. as a percentage of the population, it's, you know, we're, we're way down the list. Okay. I, I've got a list in front of me of the top so the largest the cities in the u.s that have the largest uh percentage of the population that is foreign born and it's miami number one at 38 percent san jose aka all the silicon valley <laughs> kind of country yeah. companies uh los angeles san francisco new york so there's it seems to be like the the wealthiest cities in the u.s have big populations of foreign born residents as well i find that interesting Yes. Yeah. Well, you know, immigrants come here for wealth and opportunity. And then by going to these places, they make them uh, a little bit wealthier.